We get a number of questions uh, here in our office in Phoenix from our criminal uh, clients particularly um, about the possibility of prosecutors withholding evidence or not turning the evidence over to them or to their public defender or to their current counsel. And plainly put, uh, that's a violation of, con of one's constitutional rights. Back in 1963, there's a case called Brady versus Maryland. And in that case, Justice William Orville Douglas uh, wrote the opinion for the court saying that suppression by the prosecution of evidence favorable to an accused person uh, upon request violates due process where the evidence is either material to guilt or to innocence or to punishment, irrespective of whether the information was held in good faith or bad faith. And so to that point, if the prosecution has evidence and it's material to your guilt or to your punishment, they have an obligation under uh, the due process clause of the Constitution to turn that evidence over to you. And we get a number of calls from defendants and uh, from their family members uh, that feel like the state hasn't or the or the federal government, if it's a federal case, hasn't turned over all of the evidence and some of that evidence may be exculpatory. And so it's important that you get all of the evidence in your hands so that the, an adequate defense can be presented to you and, and the uh, uh, knowledgeable attorney will request everything. They'll first send a preservation letter um, uh, to whoever has the evidence. Tell them don't destroy this evidence because it could get uh, it could lean into your innocence. They'll also request everything from the police department. Notes between the officers, handwritten notes, all of the police reports, text messages, social media posts. There's a myriad of things that could be requested and that should be requested that may be what we call Brady material that could be exculpatory to you. And you have a right to this information under the Constitution. And so if you are uh, interested in this uh, area because of a family member or for yourself, I urge you to give our office a call. We can help you with that matter, whether your case is in federal court or state court or one of the municipal courts. Give us a call. We'll go over this with you. Um, these are things that should have been gone over with your attorney. If you're self-represented, please call an attorney. Don't let the opportunity pass you by because there will come a point in the case where if you don't have the material, you can't use it. And so I urge you to give our office a call uh, or, or some knowledgeable attorney will be able to help you with getting this evidence that is exculpatory to you.